Well, hey, son. I wish I was doggone day. Mine was just, I mean, I couldn't tell you. I just couldn't imagine it being no better. <laughs> nah, it was a good day for real. I know it sounded like I was being a smart ass, but I really, I mean, I was, but I wasn't. It was really a good day. Um, I had another meeting today. I really did. I had another meeting. I didn't know about that till yesterday afternoon. But it started out pretty good this morning. Well, y'all seen the video, didn't you? If you didn't, <laughs> what you waiting on? So you need to go watch this, that one before you watch this one. Because then you won't know what the hell I'm talking about. Now, I really don't even know what the video from this morning was. Um, I just bought me a new um, phone holder for my car. Because if y'all have watched for any amount of time, y'all know my phone just falls off because it wants to but anyway so um today i was i was um bagging the food you know handing it to where it goes the front counter the drive through you know wherever it needs to go while i was picking at the drive through girls i said y'all slow and then they started saying i was handing out the wrong food i said i'm handing y'all the bags y'all may be handing them out to the wrong customers but i'm not like i'm giving it to y'all you know one of the little rules is you check your bag, you know, double check it, make sure you're out to the right. Anyway, I was just picking it, give them, giving them a hard time, telling them they was being slow, because, you know, it's all about being fast, sure. Fast and with a smile, you know. And um, they said, well, do you want to come work drive through? I said, well, I can. I, I absolutely can. And then the general manager that's training me, the general manager, she said, oh, no, you're not going in drive through because you're going to run up my drive through time, because people are going to be starting noticing you from Facebook and shit. I said, that hurt my heart. Like, she said I would just be talking in the drive through to people. I'm like, damn. I never thought that would be a problem. So now, from now on, if I ever don't want to work drive through, <laughs> there's my new legit excuse. I'm going to be like, people's going to know me, Shook. I can't work at drive through I'm going to raise up your time. I better stay on the outskirts, okay? Because I don't like working drive through because I'm not good at drive through I'm not, I can't multitask like that anyway. Um, I can be friendly, I can take your money, I can take your order, but I can't do it all at the same time, sure. So there's my new excuse that's legit, that's been used against me, so now I'm gonna use it to my best benefit. So whenever they say, Adam, I need you to go help and drive through, I'm gonna say, um, people may notice me from Facebook and shit, they may notice me from TikTok, they may notice me from YouTube. Hmm, I got my excuse. <laughs> Thank goodness. Anyway, I had a meeting today, y'all. And uh, did you see the video yesterday from when we had a meeting again, you know, yesterday too, with the big, big boss, Dan? Well, let me tell you something. Dan and Carl, it's on my video. Now, Carl's just, he's, he's a district manager. And um, he's not my district manager, but he's a district manager. He's part of the one that put on the meeting yesterday. And poor old Carl, I think I hurt his feelings because I told, I said yesterday in the video that um, the meeting was boring and I kept falling asleep. And Carl, I think Carl felt some kind of way because um, he he did all the boring parts. Cause Dan Dan was smart, and I didn't realize Dan was being smart until Carl told on him today. After Dan had left, Carl said Dan let him do all the boring parts, and Carl and no, yeah, Dan let him do all the boring parts, and Carl and Dan just got to do the fun parts. He he's talked about the fun stuff. He made it interesting. Well, I'll be damned. The new phone chart holder ain't working is so I'm gonna take this bitch back. But anyway, so you know how yesterday in my video I said that um, Dan was like a paid spokesperson for my um, social media, but all I did was YouTube. Let me tell you, I could have crawled under the table soon when I got in there to that meeting. Could have crawled under the table. When I got in there, guess what the first slideshow was? A big old picture of me. Because part of our meeting today, we was going to be introducing each other and telling fun facts about each other and all that. Well, Carl was going to be introducing me. I didn't know this ahead of time. So the bit, the first slideshow was my that cheesy picture of me that's on my cameo and on my YouTube or whatever. Just me, just smiling like that. So it was a big old picture of me listed with all of my social media platforms. And he went through all of my social media platforms. And he told him how many followers I had on each one. And he was up to date. Because as of this morning, on Facebook, I hit 531,000. And uh, that's the number he said, sure. I'm at 532 now, um, thousand now, Carl, just to let you know. But um, 
So he had it up to date. So he was, they had it all set up and ready. And I was like, I was embarrassed. But anyway, that was funny. They got me back. So um, the meeting today was not boring at all. I didn't go to sleep. I dozed a couple times, but I don't think Carl saw me, even though I was in the front front, front row, right by myself, sitting right by myself, because I didn't have nobody sitting with me. Um, I don't think Carl saw me doze off, but it was just because I was sitting down. It wasn't because the meeting was born. We got to learn a lot of new things about um, the company that we work for that I didn't know. So that's interesting. I like to learn new things that's interesting that means something. So that was pretty fun. Um, let's see, there was something else I was going to tell you. Oh, so I'm trying to come up. I don't like this phone. Let me see. Maybe it's something I'm doing. Okay, we'll try that. Um, so I'm trying to come up with something because the company that I work for, they do charity things. And um, they raise money for charities. And so I'm trying to figure out, because y'all know I do not mix work and social media together. I mean, I talk about work, but I don't say where I work for. So I don't, I don't mix the two. So I'm trying to figure out because... Y'all met Brenda yesterday on my video. Um, Brenda won in our district for raising the most money the last time that they did it. And I know Brenda because Brenda used to work at the old workhouse with me. And I had a different name for her back then. Y'all would remember. But I don't remember what her name was. So I changed it to Brenda for this workhouse. Okay. We both left and went to the same new workhouse. But anyway, Brenda won. And I'm like, I can't let Brenda beat me. So I was talking to my big, big boss, Dan. And I was like, Dan... There's got to be a way I can use my social media powers to win this contest to, for charity. You know, it's for kids. It's not It's not just, it's for kids' charity. It's a real charity. I was like, but I don't want to cross over the two because this is my social media. And I want to be able to say what I want to say. So, you can't, you can't, I'm not crossing over the two. So, Dan really liked the idea. So, we're trying to figure out some way that I can let my social media family help me raise money whenever it comes we're not doing it right now whenever it comes so that i can be the winning store for the kids in need for the charity so that i can be brenda so do y'all think y'all think that would be cool because i think it will we just got to work out the little kinks and we got a couple months to do it in but i like working for a company that that's oh mr 18 wheeler excuse me shook we got to share the road sharing is caring shook you get that side, I'll get this side, okay? So anyway, I want to be the winner for the kids' charity. So somehow we're going to work this in so that I can use my social media powers to help win and beat Brenda and help the kids. So I think that's going to be pretty cool. Brenda don't like the idea because she thinks that I'm cheating. But um, Brenda can start her YouTube and TikTok and Facebook and Instagram at any time and compete with me if she, does, if she so chooses to do that's between her and the good Lord above. That does not have nothing to do with me. So. It's what it is. Sure. So I'm thinking somehow I might create like a cash app or a PayPal. For separate from my stuff. For like the charity thing. And then. Because it would be like me donating the money. Because y'all wouldn't know where my workhouse was. I don't know. We got to figure out the all the points out but i just want to kind of let y'all in on a sneak peek of it just so y'all can be thinking about it. and y'all can let me think know any ideas if y'all think that's a good idea or don't think it's a good idea because you know i like to run everything by y'all i mean y'all family hell i talk to y'all more than i talk to anybody else <laughs> but anyway so today was a good day it was a really good day um i was scared they weren't gonna feed us because the meeting was at um 12 45 and i figured they was gonna say because I've worked for some places like this before. I figured they was going to say, well, it's 1245. They should have done eight. So I grabbed me something from the workhouse on the way to the meeting. Because they fancy. They had us a meeting at the Hilton Garden Inn this time. Nice and cool. It was good. Yesterday, this wasn't as big of a meeting. So I grabbed me something to eat on the way there. And then they come in with some pizza. So, you know, I'm a fat ass, so I ate twice. And then they had chocolates on the table. And being I was sitting at a table by myself, I ate all the chocolates there. And then I reached behind to Dan's table. Dan had done layup, and I ate his chocolates. And then they had some fruit. So it made me feel better to eat some fruit. So I ate two apples. I never did get to the banana. But I said, if y'all keep having these meetings, I'm going to be fat. Because in order for me to stay awake while I'm sitting down, I have to continue to eat. So... 
maybe I won't have a meeting for a little while. But it was not because Carl was born with his presentation, because Carl was not born at all. Did I ever tell y'all Carl was not born with this presentation? <laughs> Carl was not born with this presentation. Carl did a real good job at it. He did. So, um, but anyway, so that's it for today. I'm on the way to the to the house. Um, I'm gonna go feed all these damn animals. And I think I'm going to try to go to bed early because I close tomorrow. So I'm going to try to sleep all day. Well, it won't be all day because I have to leave about two. But I'm going to try to sleep a lot of hours. I'm going to try to sleep a lot of hours because I feel like I deserve it and I feel like I need it. And if anything else, just because I damn want to. And that's a good enough reason for me, sure. So anyway, I hope y'all had a great day. And um, we'll see you tomorrow, show it on the YouTube. I might post some shit on the TikTok later, I don't know, but it'll be on here on YouTube too. But anyway, see you later, Sean.